Honda lays out ambitious Zero Series EV plans, confirms CES 2025 concept. The automaker has grand plans that could lead to lighter, slimmer, and smarter EVs. Honda has outlined its EV vision, which includes a dedicated platform and innovative manufacturing techniques. The Zero Series will feature a thin, light, and wise design with advanced technology for efficiency. By 2030, it plans to launch seven Zero Series models globally, targeting significant EV sales growth. During Honda's Zero Tech Meeting 2024, the automaker laid out its roadmap for the future. Its new Zero Series of electric vehicles is designed around a thin, light, and wise philosophy. Here's a breakdown of what that means, how Honda plans to implement it, and what we can expect next. Take one long look at Honda's EV lineup, and it's clear the offerings aren't exactly robust. The prologue, based on GM Bones, while offering decent range and a spacious interior, can't carry the brand alone in the face of fierce EV competition. Honda's solution? The Zero Series, starting with a flagship car based on the wedge-shaped saloon concept showcased at CES 2024. Honda's ambitions, however, extend far beyond a single model. By 2030, the brand plans to roll out seven Zero Series models globally, with five of them being crossovers. Production kicks off in Ohio in 2025, utilizing cutting-edge techniques like megacasting to reduce production costs by 35%. By the end of the decade, it aims to sell 750,000 EVs in North America alone, staking its claim as a major player in the electrification race. Today, we're getting more insight into what the production version will incorporate into the design. For example, Honda wants the Zero Series to feature a thin approach. It says that means a vehicle that features short overhangs and low overall height. In addition, it hopes to also include more cabin space at the same time. Those are features that most modern EVs don't boast together since the battery pack not only takes up cabin space but often increases overall height. A case in point is the new electric BMW 5 Series, which uses visual tricks like a dark side skirt to make the car appear lower than it is. Honda also wants this new series to be light. That means being both sporty but also exceptionally efficient. These features benefit one another as a lighter car will often feel more spry to drive. Honda credits its new EV-dedicated platform for enabling this goal. Part of the magic lies in the newly developed e-axle, which features an inverter that's 40% smaller than previous iterations. The new battery casing is also 6% thinner, integrated into the vehicle's body structure to maintain safety. Steer-by-wire technology is another key element, potentially improving packaging and further contributing to the brand's efficiency goals. To top it all off, Honda is integrating active aerodynamics to reduce drag and extend range. In addition to these innovations, Honda is also stepping up in the autonomous driving space. It plans to introduce Eyes Off Level 3 self-driving capabilities across the Zero Series lineup. This tech allows drivers to divert their attention from the road under certain conditions, competing with Tesla's autonomous features. That brings us to Honda's third pillar, wisdom. Wisdom here isn't just about learning from the past but ensuring the vehicle gets smarter over time. Honda will develop its original vehicle OS, operating system, then, in line with the advancement of connected technologies, strive to offer new mobility experiences to customers by applying intelligent technologies optimized for each customer. Even after purchase, Honda plans to continuously enhance vehicle functions via over-the-air OTA updates. This means each Zero Series car will evolve, becoming more refined and optimized as time goes on, making the vehicle more of a dynamic living product. All of these features will be integrated into a total of seven Honda Zero Series models globally by 2030. What's next? We're set to see one of these new models debut at CES 2025. While the company hasn't revealed specific details yet, it stated that this new model will be the embodiment in product form of the technologies and electrification concept introduced during the Honda Zero Tech meeting. Can Honda really achieve all of this and become a big player in the EV market? Only time will tell, but let's wait to tout all of these as genuine breakthroughs until we can drive the real product.